Sometimes if it's a rounded corner, then you'll have to make two slots. By uh, on this section here straight, so I can actually just fold it back here. Um, explain this. Here, straight section here and there. So you know, like here, I don't have mark at all. This, the original area just rotted away. But since I know it's a straight line from here, I can just fold it along here.
uh, comfortable to just using your eyesight. You know, just um, just go ahead and draw a line here.
Remember, the old, the original panel has to be you know, together with the, um, the new one. The sides here aren't welded, so I can still, you know, fold this here this way. See, as the uh, as I fold here, the uh, these um, folds here on this side they overlap each other, and that distance is what determines the curvature. And you know, once it's curved enough, well, in place so that it no longer moves. It's not good to fold the metal all the way because you know if it's not folded all the way, then it's, uh, it's more rigid. So by having this uh, big ridge here, it's going to allow this part not to uh, curve anymore. This section I don't want to curve anymore. It's still the original and it's still pretty strong and good. So I know there's going to be you know it's not going to be any adjustments. Down here is probably gonna need it's probably gonna need some adjustments. say not to fold you know, just one side at once but here it's got to be all in place and it doesn't really matter. Now we have a sharp corner here but what I'll do is I'll put some welds in uh, through the inside here. You can just grind off the axis.
metal in this corner. 